myself sunil sharma working with ss instruments private limited turki today i will demonstrate the working of thermoluminescence experiment uh, model tlx02 when you open the carton you will get the high voltage power supply uh, which can go up to the 1500 volt with negative polarity digital nanometer that can measure in the range of 100 microampere to 100 picoampere thermoluminescence temperature meter with rate of heating 10 to 12 kelvin per minute small oven with rtd sensor and crystal holder the maximum temperature range of this oven is 423 kelvin or 150 degree centigrade the black box black box consists of photomultiplier tube PMT housing with biasing circuit, sample of alkali halide crystals KCl and KBr, black cover, two connecting leads. Assembly of black box first. Open the PMT housing. Remove the PMT housing cover and insert the PMT tube gently in its socket. It should be done in dim light and cover it. Now fix the PMT housing in its original position in black box. To check the working of PMT cover lid, put slightly downward pressure and rotate clockwise and anti-clockwise to open and close the window position. Normally it is in closed position. connect the cable with the pmt housing firmly and place the oven on its stand the alignment of oven of and pmt window is in same when it is in open condition generate the f center in given sample kcl by irradiating the same with x ray source or our irradiation unit TiU02 the sample changes its color after irradiation violet color in KCL and light blue in KBR now take out uh, the lid of the oven outside the oven with the sample holder and place the sample within this holder now this lid put it into o1 as the position the crystal at around the center of the o1 window now put it back this o1 on its own stand and open the pmt housing window and ensure that the flat face of the crystal faces the pmt window now close the black box and cover it with black cover it will protect the pmt tube from stray light now select the 100 nanoampere range in the nanometer and adjust the zero with the help of zero adjuster and connect the lead and four pin connector connect with the thermoluminescence temperature meter and the lead of the uh, high voltage power supply now increase the voltage up to the 800 volt gradually
and it will be fixed throughout the experiment. Let the system stabilize for about 15 minutes. Now switch on the oven. If required, a de-adjust to the zero. Take the observations of intensity in form of current with the help of a digital nanometer versus temperature. Record the readings with the rising temperature at regular intervals. As the temperature rises, current will also rise till it reaches its peak. After that, current will decrease with rise in temperature. The plot of these readings, intensity versus temperature, will give us a glow curve. The glow curve gives us the value of transition temperature Tg. Putting this Tg in formula, we can get activation energy E. Details are given in our user's manual. Finally, we will be calculating the activation energy of sample for details, please refer to the user's manual of this experiment. Thank you for seeing this video. For details of our other products, please visit our website www.sasinstruments.com. Thank you. Have a nice day.